I tell you what, after that meal we've been eating today, oh. I feel like uh, we need something light and easy. I was just uh, gonna say that I'm getting a little full. We're getting a little full, we get a little <laughs> light and easy here. So, easy part we have nailed, zabonio, okay. okay, which is like the most easy thing. Fancy for what? Fancy work for cooked eggs. Cooked right, so we're gonna cook okay. the egg yolks, okay? All right. We're gonna mix that with a little bit of, um, sometimes champagne, sometimes white wine. I'm a fan of whatever we're drinking, using it. I don't wanna open oh, up something for it, right? Yeah. You can, some people make it with like Madeira or Sherry or something, something mm -hmm. sweet. You can use an alcohol, whatever you want. We're gonna use a little red wine. Okay. Okay. Sugar. I'm gonna whisk those all over a double boiler. So I'll show you what a double boiler is after, but your favorite thing to I do. I feel like you're I know in, what you're I'm in, doing. You're in, you're in I need, Separating I need, eggs. I need four yolks. You got it. Okay. I need four yolks. And over here, behind, okay. I'm gonna set this up. I'm gonna bring this over here. Fill the yolks and go right into this bad boy. First. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah. Might as well go right in. I'm gonna put a little bit of sugar in here. Okay. Add a little bit of sugar in here. Yep. You just mix it right in the bowl. Just right in the bowl. Okay. Okay. And a little bit of red wine. Right. Oh wait, that didn't work out so well. That's okay. That's okay. Just go like this. Yep. Okay. Now I'll get that one out of your rack. Boom. So here we have some berries. I mean, you could use strawberries. These are really delicious. We saw these at the market. Uh, big fat blue, uh, big flat raspberries. Delicious, kind of snag one when we, when we were over there tasting them. Yeah. You want to make sure your berries are nice and plump. You could use strawberries in it. You could use fruit, figs, whatever seasonal, right? Yeah, I love getting the berries like at Jacob's Berry oh, Farm. Oh, the best. They're yeah, the down best. in Gardnerville, it's really great. All right. So okay. we have those in here next. Yeah. yeah. I'll give it up your hands. Okay. All right. And then let's go over here, and we're gonna put this on the double boiler. Okay. All right, so all, double broiler. All the double boiler is, okay? All the double boiler is right here. I have a pot of water going. Okay. Okay, it's boiling water. Mm -hmm. I put my, my pan right inside of here. This is okay. gonna slowly cook the egg yolks. If I put it right on okay. the, if I put it directly on the flame, they're gonna scramble. Mm -hmm. So now the water helps kind of. Is this similar like when we make meringue, or like the lemon meringue? Yep, this is where similar we to make, this is similar to making uh, lemon curd. Lemon curd, that's it's similar, what it is. Okay. Similar to making hollandaise, Yeah. Right? And so what we're going to do here is kind of use. That's right? a figure eight method. That's a figure eight method, mm -hmm. right? We learned that in school yeah. all day long to stand here, right? We want to kind of stand in the wood. The part that I like about it is it's really simple. Mm -hmm. And the red wine and the sugar are going to flavor it and make it sweet. But I'm going to show you. It's going to look what it looks like now. Okay. okay? It's really just a little frothy. Mm -hmm. Okay. I'm going to let you kind of beat it a little bit. I'm okay. going to hold the pan. You hold the right. pan. Yeah. Is there a favorite dish that you make using this double broiler? I mean, I'd probably or? say, I probably, this is one of my crutch. I have like a couple really good recipes for dessert, not that many. Budino being one. Oh, right? the yeah, world famous. World Budino. Got to go all the way to the bottom. Got to go all the way to the bottom, get the perfect <laughs> bite, come back right yep. up from the top, right? But I love making uh, that warm chocolate cake that we love, the flower chocolate oh, cake. Yeah, that, that we, is delicious. We make a, like, you know, we probably have two million Budino sold and a million warm chocolate cakes sold. Yeah. But my kind of crutch one to make, especially here in, a, in the kitchen like this, would be this zabonion, right? I mean, it's looking a little it, different it starts now, to huh? come, It starts to come together a little bit, right? The ribbons. Wow, yeah. So I'm gonna pick this up because I can see that boil. Okay. Right? So if it gets a little too hot, I just pick it up. Out comes the steam, right? Yeah. You feel the steam right there? Mm -hmm. And we go back inside, okay. right? Oh, see here? Right. right. It looks like it's pretty thick it's now. It's getting thick. The sugar, the egg yolks, mm -hmm. okay, the whiskey. Right. And about how long does this take? This will be any, it depends on how hot this is underneath, right? So I want to kind of turn it down. It can make it a little bit less, right? Turn it down a little bit. But okay, you can go. get this done in like three yeah. minutes. I can cook. If we were in a rush, we get this done in like three minutes or faster. Okay. Really? And you remember what it was like? Ooh, it to come to get yeah, it's starting to look pretty. A little bit more ribbons. Mm -hmm. It's, it's like, not like, separated it, anymore it's, either. It won't, yeah, because mm -hmm. we start, we got it all kind of together. The heat, the heat cooks the egg yolks slowly. Great. And then the sugar, the red wine, add the flavor. Yeah, yeah you want to taste it? Um, ah. Yes, I do want to taste it. Yes. Go. What's it taste like? Do we need more sugar? Oh. Right? Wow. Really simple. Really delicious. Right? It's almost like this cream. I'm watching now. Yeah, right? nice. Looking for this ribbon for maybe about another 30 seconds. So, what thickness are you looking for? The ribbons. You'll know. You want to go to ribbons. What does ribbons mean? So, when you come through here. Oh, okay. Right? See this? Uh, the ribbons kind of coming kind of like stays. that? Kind of stays. Yep. Mm -hmm. All together, and then inside the bowl is another way to look at it. So I go through. Mm -hmm. and you, see, you can see inside here. You can see it stays apart in the bowl. So oh not, yeah, I see. Right? Mm -hmm. So there are ribbons. We're just yeah, here. it's not all falling back together. Take it apart. Take it apart. Here. Okay. Bring it over here. Okay. All right, we're back. We're back. Let's set this plate up. 
And I'm thinking this was some like dramatic look, right? I'm gonna pick this up and we'll put this Something down first, fancy. right? Yeah. We might as well fancy might it up. Fancy it up. And then you can do a little bit of uh, Jackson Pollock and you just get some berries in there, right? Okay. Splatter the berries around any way you want. Okay. Okay. Yeah. You do one too, all over. Yeah, wherever you want. Great. Yeah. Get we can do it together. It. We can do okay. it together. I like that mosaic oh, look. Oh, I love that. Right? Yeah. Just kind of whatever. Mm -hmm. Throw them on there. <laughs> Oh, yeah, more, more is no, more is plenty. Okay. Okay. Take this looks great. Oh, so yeah, light right. looking, babe. All right. Mm -hmm. and if you want to, I don't think we need to, but you could. You put a little more on top if you want to, a little top of here. Oh, that's right uh, Get out, get out. <laughs> <laughs> so, I mean, after a nice meal, right? Yes. We're looking at this right here. I love using the wine because now we can, we can say, hey, this goes with it to a certain degree. Yeah. But this dessert. Cheers. Cheers. Super simple, and let's see how it eats. Okay. Right? It's light. It ends up being mostly fruit. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that oh, sugar, that my sugar makes it so good. And really, wow. it's so easy. I would have never guessed to put red wine mm -hmm. in with that to make this. Unbelievable. It's got smart over the years. Got smart over the years. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, I mean, I'll tell you what. Mm. What a simple ending wow. to a really great dinner. We yeah. started off with the poor look of the pasta, right? Mm -hmm. And the beautiful love letters that we, we made together. <laughs> yeah. I love the fact that, that we had them, we got to kind of glam it up, oh. if you will. Mm -hmm. And we glammed it up yes. with uh, steak and the crab legs. Four minutes right? on each you side like that, for right? the filet. You, you nailed that, yep. it was perfect. We let it rest for a minute, right? And then we hit it up here with a little zabagnon, whatever berries of fruit that are out there. Yeah, really easy. Really I mean, light. in the kitchen really together with you, honestly, today, tonight, has been one of the coolest experiences of my life. I know a lot of cool things. And, uh, this is really, really fun. I hope that we get to do this together a little bit more. And, yes. uh, you know, being here, cooking on the Z-Line equipment, I mean, you know, it can't happen without that. You gotta have yeah. the proper tools. We had our mise en place all set up, right? Mm -hmm. We have awesome, co uh, awesome cooking equipment to work with. And uh, you are like my favorite thing in the entire world. So happy Valentine's Day, babe. Happy Valentine's Day. I love Day. you so much. Love you too. Okay. <laughs> <laughs>